Good morning, pumpkin! Are you still in bed? I'm coming in! Rise and shine, sleepyhead! It's gorgeous out! You don't want to waste the day in bed, do you? It's so early, Mom! <sighs> Come back later. Honestly, you can't spend your vacation lying in bed. And d did you sleep in your brand new suit? I had a late night. It's tough being vice president of the world. You've been in office one day. Oh, if only the voters could see you now. My son, the slouch. At least go say hi to your brother. He took the day off to come and see you. You missed breakfast, by the way. Maybe you can stop by the bakery later. But don't spoil your appetite. We're having an early supper tonight. Cha-ching! Cha-ching! You. Hmm. 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 Hey, little bro. Long time no see. Good morning, um, Mr. Vice President. Gee, what do I call you now? Oh, come now. There's no need for formalities. Sir will do just fine. Oh, okay. Hey, I got you a present, sir. I left it downstairs for you. Why, little bro, you aren't trying to bribe me now that I'm in office, are you? No, of course not. It's just a little something for winning the election. We're just about to reveal what Jack's evil twin looks like. I swear you boys are lost without your mother, huh? All right, let's get some fresh air before all my days of our bold and the restless starts. This calls for a mother's touch. Capitalism at its finest. How you like it? Pretty nifty, huh? I absolutely love it. What is it, a laptop? I'm confused. It's a tablet. It's like a phone, but bigger. You can do your big, important work on the go now, even at a coffee shop. Ah, now you're speaking my language. What's a world leader got to do to get a cup of coffee around here? I'll take you to Moonbucks. They just opened one across the street. Let's do this. Check it out, Ma! My adoring public, here to congratulate me on my meteoric rise to power. Actually, um, they don't look too happy. Nonsense! That's envy, you see! This is exactly why I got into politics in the first place! So glad you're home, Mr. VP! Why, thank you! It's nice to relax after an election. You here for an autograph? The only signing that's going on is my sign! And your face! Whoa! My face is my livelihood! Little bro, this is all you. Honey, you have to learn to fight your own battles one day. Hmm? Aww.
All right, here we go. You like that, huh? No fair! This calls for a celebration! Mother knows best! I knew I could do it! Vice President, do you have time for an interview? What's on your mind, sir? How's it feel to be home now that you've won the election, sir? It was a hard election, and our opponents did well. I'm just glad I get to finally visit my mother now. How sweet. Keeping in touch with your roots, huh? That always looks good in the polls. The polls are great and all, but I just wanted to drop off my laundry. Three months on the road, this stuff piles up. Oh, I see. So tell me, what's the secret to that fabulous hair and your signature smile? Simple, really. Two handfuls of product and a whole lot of baking soda. Mr. Vice President, what's on your mind, sir? That sounds right up my alley. I have a couple stories I'm tracking down first, though. I need to get some pictures of a local man's car that wound up in a lake nearby. And I need pictures for a story about how bright lights might revitalize the dwindling shipping industry. Wow, I didn't realize you were an actual journalist. Those stories sound a little over my head. Trust me, you'll want your face in these pictures. Local flavor kind of stuff. Plus, I need to switch my lenses. So why don't you... Don't forget to protect me. How'd that feel? You like that, huh? Hey, look out! We did it! All right, here we go! You like that, huh? You're grounded! Never doubted you for a second. Imagine the headlines. VP steals car. Thanks, but no thanks. Imagine the headlines. VP... Hmm. You look like a man who knows where to get a good strong sarsaparilla. You're in luck, my friend. I own the local soda shop. But to be honest, I think I'll just stay here all day. This iced special blend is drinking quite well today. Guys with beards don't like being disturbed from their coffee. I'll leave him be. This protest is interrupting school. Oh well. Preposterous! Let me see what I can do about this. I don't mind, so long as I got this delicious special blend. <laughs> Either he's one of those caffeine junkies you hear about, or something weird's going on here. Psst! Hey, come here. Huh? Yeah, you! What can I do for you, taxpayer? I don't pay taxes. I also don't drink the coffee. Neither should you. Taxes and coffee are two of my favorite things. They contaminated the coffee. Can't you taste it? It's so dark and aromatic. Bold, even. I was abducted once, you know. Aliens. They ran tests on me. Back in Uranus. They walk among us, don't you get it? 
Don't things seem just a little bit off to you? We need proof. It's the only way. Proof and a refill. Lots of refills. Here's what we'll do. You go find proof while I head to the police station. I'm good at talking, so let me handle that. You can track down evidence. Sound good? Stay strong, brother. Hello? Oh, sorry. My mind was just drifting away from me there. Is something wrong? Not really. Just waiting for my manager to come in. He's never late. 